Hi friends, uh, my name is Shaitanya Patke and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to analyze the 69th game uh, of the Tata IPL 2024 which took place at the Rajiv Gandhi International Cricket Stadium uh, between home team, uh, the Sunrisers Hyderabad and Punjab Kings and it was a thriller of a game. Uh, eventually, Sunrisers Hyderabad won it by 4 wickets. Uh, the match uh, had no consequences uh, on the IPL playoff qualification as we knew that Punjab Kings were already out of it. Uh, but uh, Sunrisers Hyderabad uh, did a magnificent chase and uh, despite the fact of being the most fancied team uh, at the halfway stage it looked that Punjab Kings had this game uh, well into their pocket uh, but a magnificent batting effort and a Herculean batting task by Sunrisers Hyderabad ensured that they romped home by 4 wickets and uh, this uh, victory also ensured uh, that there was a perception that Sunrisers Hyderabad bat well only when they are batting first chasing uh, they have uh, always floundered except uh, for the chase against chennai super kings in uh, which abhishek sharma played exceptionally uh, exceptionally well and what a coincidence in this game also uh, when sunrisers hyderabad chased a daunting total uh, Abhishek Sharma came out trumps with a magnificent innings of 66 of just 28 deliveries at a strike rate in excess of 235 uh, which I will analyze in a few moments uh, to win the player of the match award for its magnificent effort. Uh, the toss as I said was won by Punjab Kings and they chose to bat first uh, which is all what they always do in this tournament. Uh, and uh, they posted a healthy total of 214 for 5 in their allotted 20 overs. 10 extras were considered by the Sunrisers Hyderabad bowler. Atharva Taide played a magnificent innings of 46 of just 27 deliveries, 5 boundaries along with 2 sixes uh, at a strike rate in excess of 170. Great flicks, great cover drives. Uh, the 6 over uh, long one was a sight to behold. Uh, his uh, uh, innings was ended by T. Natarajan with Sanvir Singh taking a simple catch. Prab Simran Singh impressed one and all once again. 71 of just 45 deliveries for the uh, Mercurial Punjab, uh, Punjab Kings opener. 7 boundaries and 4 massive sixes uh, at the strike rate of in excess of 155. Uh, rotated the strike pretty well and one good aspect of Prab Simran, uh, Prab Simran Singh's batting is that he even hits the good balls for 4. On the rise, he never afraid to use his feet against the fast bowler. He is equally proficient against the spinners as well. And uh, magnificent uh, season once again for Prab Simran. Uh, Riley Russo, the South African, contributed very nicely. Scored in excess of 200 strike rate. Very unfortunate not to get a 50, 49 of 24 deliveries at a strike rate uh, of ex in excess of 200. Pat Cummins took his wicket with Abdul Samad taking a simple catch. And Prab Simran Singh uh, was dismissed by Vijay Kant uh, with Heinrich Lassen taking a simple catch behind the stumps. Uh, Shashank Singh uh, was run out unfortunately in this game uh, for 2 of 4 deliveries by Ritish Kumar Reddy. The skipper Jitesh Sharma, 32 of 15 deliveries, gave a very good account of himself, clean striker of the ball, uh, in excess of 210 strike rate, couple of boundaries along with couple of sixes. Ashutosh Sharma was out for 2 of 3 deliveries, Natarajan took his wicket with Sanveer Singh taking the catch, Shivan Singh was not out on 2 of 3 deliveries, so a pretty healthy total. Uh, Bhuvneshwar Kumar had an off night, 4 overs, 36 runs, no wicket. Pat Cummins also was expensive by his lofty standards, 4 overs, 36 runs, 1 wicket. Uh, T. Natarajan in 4 overs, uh, 33 runs, 2 wicket bowled extremely well. Nailed the Orker pretty brilliantly towards the uh, latter stages of the innings. Vijay Khan, 4 overs, 37 runs, 1 wicket. Uh, Shahbaz Ahmed in 1 over gave away 3 runs. And um, Nitish Kumar Reddy in 3 overs was strong to all over the places but he will learn from this experience the 21 year old order, 20 year old all rounder I beg your pardon 3 overs 54 runs 18 economy rate is not acceptable at all chasing a target of 215 uh, Abhishek Sharma came out all guns blazing despite the fact of Travis Head being cleaned up by Arshdeep Singh of the very first delivery itself it was a ripper of a delivery 66 of 28 6 massive sixes over square leg over long off over long on uh, and 5 boundaries at a strike rate of 235 uh, what a sight to behold Abhishek Sharma is all round player timed the ball extremely nicely uh, looks very elegant looks very good on the eye and his timing was impeccable that is uh, his hallmark of the game uh, his wicket was taken by Shashank Singh uh, with Shivam Singh taking the catch but not before a magnificent innings uh, Rahul Tripathi also provided the much uh, needed impetus in the Middle order 33 of 18 deliveries, 2 massive 6 6 along with 4 boundary. His wicket was taken by Harshal Patel with Ashutosh Singh taking the catch. Nitish Kumar Reddy, a good innings in the middle uh, order 37 of 20, 5 deliveries, 3 massive 6 6 and 1 4 scored at a strike rate of more than 140. Three party scored at a strike rate of 183. 
uh, he, uh, the wicket of Kreti was taken by Harshal Patel with Sanveer Singh uh, with Shashank Singh taking the catch I beg your pardon Hendrik Larsen 42 uh, of 26 delivery once again continuing on his merry way as I said in my previous video as well he is the best white ball middle order batsman in the world doesn't get the respect they deserve but it is high time that commentators and fans uh, talk and rave about his brilliance uh, three boundaries, two sixes. He was cleaned up by Harpreet Bala, which was a magnificent delivery. Shahbaz Ahmed, three of six deliveries. His wicket was taken by Ashutosh Singh with Shashank Singh taking the catch. Abdul Samad was not out with one magnificent blow, 11 of 6 deliveries. Sanveer Singh, 6 of 4 deliveries with a solitary boundary. 17 extras were considered by the uh, Punjab Kings bowler, which is uh, not very uh, acceptable but it is what it is the uh, when ballers are going to all round uh, of the park they try some variations and in that they do something extra and the number of extras are increased 215 for 6 in 19.1 overs uh, and uh, yeah Arshdeep Singh uh, was the standout bowler for Punjab Kings 4 overs 37 runs 2 wicket Rishi Dhawan had an off night 3 overs 35 runs no wicket Harshal Patel took 2 runs but gave away uh, runs at more than 12.5 per overs which is unacceptable that has been the problem with Harshal Patel he is taking the wickets but he is giving away too many runs so his first season was not memorable with Punjab Kings at all pretty ordinary outing Rahul Chair also has disappointed his graph has gone below since the past couple of IPLs I don't know what is the reason 4 overs 43 runs no wicket Harpreet Brar uh, took 1 wicket but gave away runs at more than 12 runs uh, 12 runs per over three, exactly 3 overs 36 runs Shashank Singh 1 over 5 runs 1 wicket uh, maybe uh, uh, Jitesh Sharma could have uh, given 1 more over to Shashank Singh who knows and Atharva Tide 0.1 over 4 runs no wicket so all in all a magnificent performance by the batting of Sunrisers Hyderabad and Punjab Kings uh, might rue their chances that they have uh, done throughout the season so uh, this victory will stand Sunrisers Hyderabad in good uh, neck for the upcoming playoffs so how did you like my analysis of this game please tell me in the comment section below and don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for further notifications we'll meet in the next video till then everyone bye